Hello and welcome to the channel. In this tutorial, I will show you how to design the simple molder in FreeCAD as a way to practice drawing in FreeCAD. So, first, here we need a new document. Click in this icon here to create a new document and now change the workbench here to part design. And next, create a body and a new sketch. For this sketch here, select XY plane. And here in this first sketch, we'll draw a square. We'll draw the sketch with these dimensions here 100. And 100. So first here, go to sketch geometers, and here, click in this arrow and select center the rectangle. And now in this origin point, and draw this rectangle. And next, select this equal constraint and these two lines. And now here we have a square with one degree of freedom. So the next step is to set the, the dimension of this sketch. So first here, we go to this tool here horizontal distance and now click in this line here and set 100 and now as you can see this sketch is full constrained so now close this sketch and press home if you like what you see please subscribe to the channel and leave a like in this video i also have a coffee page in which you can donate to support the channel if you want link to this page can be found in the description of this video thank you and next, click in this pad tool and change the length of this pad here to 25, this dimension here. And enter. So now, as you can see, we have this part here. And the next step is to make this fillet here. Okay, so what to do? Select this edge and click in this fillet icon. And now we'll change the radius here to 20. This dimension here, change here to 20. And now click in this add button and add these three edges here. And now click OK. And now we'll create a fillet in this space here. So we'll create a fillet of with a radius of 10 millimeters. So here, select this face and click in this fillet icon and change the radius here to 10 and enter. And now, as you can see, we have this fillet here. And the next step here is to create these pockets, these four pockets. So first here, we'll draw a sketch. So first here, select this face and now create a new sketch here and what to do here, select this external geometry tool and extra this edge here and this edge. Okay, and here we'll draw a rectangle. So first here, go to sketch geometers and click in this arrow and select rectangle tool. And now draw this rectangle. And next here we'll set the placement of this point here. So let's see the string page. Okay, here we can see this horizontal dimension here. We have 20 here. So we select this horizontal distance tool and now we select this point and this end point here and we set the dimension here is 20. So we select this point here and this point and we set 20. And now let's see the vertical distance. Okay, the vertical distance is 20. So what we do here, we select this vertical distance tool and now we select this point and this point here and we set 20. Okay, and now leave the sketch and now create a pocket here with a length of, okay, here we have these dimensions here, 25 and this dimension here. So the length of the pocket here will be 12. So change here to 12 and now click OK. Now, as you can see, we have this. And next here, we'll make the fillets in this pocket here. OK, so the first fillet will be, will be this with thirds of 5. So what you do here, you will select this edge, select this edge and now create a fillet here with a of 5. 
and now click OK and next here we'll create this fillet here the range of this fillet is 2 millimeters so here we select this edge and we create a fillet here with a range of 2 OK and now click OK and next here to make these four pockets and fillets what we do we go to model and here first we select this pocket and next this fillet and this fillet here and we go to the polar button tool and here we change the number of occurrence to four Okay, and as you can see now we have these pockets and fillets. So next click OK. And what we'll do next, next here we'll create this pocket here, this internal pocket with a thickness of 1.9. So to create this pocket, what we do first here we select this bottom face and now this thickness tool here and first here check this option make thickness in words and change the value here to 1.9 and now as you can see we have this pocket here and now click OK and the next step here is to create pockets here in this space so here we'll draw, uh, we'll make a new sketch in this face here with, with these cylinders here. So what we do, first select this face here and create a new sketch here. And now go to sketch geometers and select cycle tool. And now draw this cycle and next we'll set the demo of this cycle here. So select this constraint here and now let's see the value of the diameter. The diameter of these cycles is 6. So select this cycle here and set 6. Okay, and next here we'll set the placement of this cycle. Okay, so first here we can see this vertical dimension here. So what we do here, we select this vertical distance tool and now the center point and this origin point and the distance here will be the length of fifth so it will be 25 okay and next here we'll set the horizontal dimension horizontal distance so okay here we see 52 so we'll do the same we select the horizontal distance tool and now this point here and this point and here we'll set 52 divided by 2 and now we got this so now this sketch is full constrained as you can see so next click close okay and now create a pocket here okay as you can see we have a pocket here and now click OK and next we'll, we'll create these, these pockets here so what we do first here we need to select this pocket and now we go to multi transform tool and here we go here and click on mouse and first here select Add linear pattern and first here we'll change the duration to x axis and we'll change this length here to 52 change here to 52 and now we'll change the number of occurrence to six. we'll change here to 6 Okay, and now as you can see, we have these six pockets here. So here, click OK, and again, right click on mouse, and now select this option again. And change the duration here to Y axis. Okay, and the length here will be this dimension here, fifth. 
set 50 here and the number of occurrence will set will set here we will set 7 and here we have to check this option reverse set duration so now as you can see we have these pockets here so now click ok here and ok and yes this and yes this model is finished the design of this model here is finished so thank you for watching this video